down here, Merc. You're coming with us! Nice and easy! I don't think so. Who in the hell? Hands where I can see him! You got this. Yeah, what he said. You're coming with us. Can't get surrounded. Nope. So what's Soldier Boy's deal? Is he one of us now? He's got balls, this, uh, uh, what was his name again? Cloud. Cloud Strife. Right. And he isn't a soldier anymore. Still, he's a professional, unlike the rest of us. I'm glad to have him. <laughs> this is a one-time gig. When it's done, we're done. Uh, uh, uh. We're gonna enjoy to work with though. Real joy to look at, too. Here we go. You'll keep us safe. Next are what people right? notice first. Huh? Guess I'm not on the same page as people. We're done here. Or even the same. Give it a rest. Come on. Nobody do something this crazy just for money. They may not think you're a true believer, but you know what I think? Not interested. What? Huh? Wedge. Uh... <sighs> you
You better be worth the money, Merc. Every last gill. So fast, we've got company. This will be quick. Soldiers may attack on command, but I hear they make good guard dogs, too. Bet you've seen a few reactors. So how do we get to the bridge above Mako storage? <clears throat> Ain't holding out on me, are you? Stamp scared to bite the hand that fed him? Or is he a loyal little doggy? <clears throat> Have it your way, Mutt. We can do this with you, or we can do this without you. Different reactor, different layout. Depends when it was built. Never seen one like this, but I'll manage.
Don't you worry. Biggs will have the door open soon. I'm watching you. In three, two... Damn, I'm good. Who's there? Door! Oh, wait! It's over! That's my line. He's alone! We can take him! Take it, Ray! Stop that. Then let's move. He always knows just what to say. Cut it out. It's a good thing I know someone who can get us the passcodes. <sighs> Pity no one else at command will talk to us, but what can you do? Then we're good. Careful in there. <laughs> I got this place covered. You know Tifa, right? It's not really my business, but are you guys close? Tifa and I... These sewer rats appear to call themselves Avalanche, sir. We are currently investigating whether they belong to the same group that made the attempt on your life. Rest assured, our inquiries will not take much longer. <laughs> this pump's sole purpose is to drain the planet dry. While you sleep, while you eat, while you shit, it's here sucking up Marco! It doesn't rest, and it doesn't care! You do realize what Marco is, don't you? Marco uh, is the lifeblood of our world. The planet bleeds green like you and me bleed red. The hell you think's gonna happen when it's all gone, huh? Answer me! You gonna stand there and pretend you can't hear the planet crying out in pain? I know you can! You really hear that? Damn straight I do! Get help. <laughs> Say that again! <sighs> I'd worry less about the planet and more about the next five seconds. Save the screaming for later. Our lives are on the line now. You listening, Merc? One false move. And that happens. Well, so much for having Cloud do all the fighting. There are some places a sword just can't reach. <laughs> just 
there with him for me, would you? <laughs> Should have asked for more money. Throw your sword at him? Let the man with the gun go to work. These tin cans ain't got nothing on me. Now for the real show. Oh. Get you! That's out of here. Still? Ain't no thing. Huh. Ah! Give him hell! Hang back. Guess it's my turn. Taking over. About damn time! This is gonna stay! here the laser security system great those things will hurt more than your pride if you're careless they'll cut you down to size and then some but I'm guessing you've done this kind of thing before yeah figure out the timing of the lasers then make a move when they cycle off exactly I'll go first nothing like a little danger to get the blood pumping hey just keep those baby blues of yours on me Sweepers for nothing. They can wipe out a whole squad in seconds. Not if you wipe the floor with them first. Ha! Ah! We can take this hunk of junk! That hunk of junk is a heavy weapons platform. If we rush in, we die. Is that right? Need to hit it with magic. That should give us an open. Now's our chance. Go! 
Don't need to tell me twice. I'm gonna enjoy this. So long. What are you? Twenty something? First. Huh? Soldier first class. Doesn't go into the twenties. The hell are you talking about? I mean your age, not your goddamn rank. I uh Rank could be the same as his age. Mm -hmm. Guess that make you a one-year-old, huh? Live and learn. That's our target, the reactor core. Gotta set the bomb at the bottom. Let's get down there. God damn. I can practically taste the mako in here. <laughs> Turn it up! Let's see if Little Stamp really can bite the hand that feeds. Hmm. Go on. Do the honors. Prove to me you're the man Tifa says you are. That you're one of us. Never said I was. I'm just here for the paycheck. Then do the damn job!
What's wrong? I'm fine. What about the timer? Your call, Merc. Pretty cocky, ain't you? Heads up! What in the hell?! Hey! How the hell do we fight this thing?! It's got reinforced armor plated, but the internals can be overloaded. Lightning magic! Huh. No other option, huh? Here it comes. Shit! Uh, should I be worried? seen this defense system before. Sir. Thought you were the expert. So what's your brilliant plan, genius? That didn't time. work either. Here we go. <laughs> Bingo. Focus on that core. Oh, now he remembers. Don't keep me waiting in suspense next time. Calling fire. Now. Hit it hard and fast. Oh, you're in for it now! Just shoot! <laughs> it's my time to shine. <laughs> or go down in flames. Quicker we're screwed. <laughs> oh, I am way ahead of you, Merc. <laughs> Gotta time our attacks just right. Hold out until you spot an opening. No holding. <laughs> Let's 
finish this. It's down! Rain hell on it! Damn thing showed you how it's done. Come on, we've got to move. Where should be covering our way out? Go, go, go! Give me a break.
missed it. That is a yes. Looks like we made it. And with nothing but a few scratches to show. <laughs> Think you might have overdone it? I followed the instructions to the letter. Maybe it triggered a reaction with the Mako? Well, let's hope the city's still in one piece. But the planet's what matters, right? <laughs> I mean, this must have helped some. After all that, it had better have. Anyway, let's get going. We in Sector 8? That'd be just down there. All right, then. Lead the way. You got it! Huh. Watch out for live wires. They're everywhere! 
Ugh. The air in here reeks. Can't wait to get out in the open. Man, what is that? I've never smelled anything so foul. Oh, it's me. Gotta do something about that. And soon. I felt that one in my guts. They just keep on coming. We need to get out of this place. Was it the Mako density? The primary explosive? The blasting agent? Hey, we can figure that out later. <sighs> I'm running on empty here. You can refuel at the base. Next time I'll have to bring a little pick-me-up. do we have to go? Not far. That's about as good a place as any. Stand back then. I'll set the bomb. Can't wait to see you, Marlene. Can't wait to take a hot shower. He's good to go. Fire in the hole! You sure told those doors. Let that be a Let's lesson to anything here. that gets in my way. Stop now. This was just the first reactor, and the planet won't be safe till we get the rest. Yeah, we always knew this was gonna get messy. And this is only the beginning. Y'all gotta look at the bigger picture here. Nothing worth fighting for was ever won without sacrifice. Though you may not be crying out, I know you're in pain, just like the planet. But it's okay, cause I'm here for you, to help take the load off your shoulders. Your fears, your worries, your concerns, and yes, your fears. Whatever your problem, I got you. Huh. Hmm. So, what's our next move, boss? That's easy enough. We get our asses home! <laughs> we'll split up and shoot for the last train home. Regroup in the freight car. Got it? Later then! Hey, I'd like my money now. You can have it once we're back at base. I don't need to tell you what this is, right? Of course not. It's healing material. 
You can have it. For saving my life. Just doing my job. Nothing more. Yeah, yeah. Fact is, I'm lucky you were there. <laughs> Survival can be a matter of luck or skill. But you can't rely on luck. Words to live by. <laughs> yeah, well, thanks. You do know how to use it, right? You do know what I was, right? for being so brave. That really was the ride of a lifetime. Well, see you on the train. Ground started shaking, and the sign just fell. We have to the station. Then we take the train. Structures in the area are at high risk of collapse, rendering the entire sector hazardous. Immediate evacuation is advised. If you observe any suspicious behavior, please inform the nearest public security officer. You may alternatively contact the security headquarters. We'll never catch another right now. There has to be another way. Cloud, up here! Look up! I said look up! Careful up here. This could collapse at any moment. If you want up, you'll have to use those stairs. Then...
You're not real. You're dead. I am. I killed you with my own... <gasps> oh, you need not remind me. It was the crowning moment of our time together. But that was then, and this is now. I have a favor to ask. Our beloved planet is dying. Slowly. Silently. Painfully. Can you bear to see the planet suffer? Cloud. Were the planet to die, so many things would be lost. Your hometown, oh, it's so bright. The sound of her voice, pleading for me this very. The shiver of her flesh, yielding to cold steel. That which binds us together would be no more, and I would be loath to live in such a world. Which is why I must ask you this one favor. Don't worry, it's a simple thing. Run, Cloud. Run away. You have to leave. You have to live. You bastard! Good, Cloud. Very good. Hold on to that hatred. I'm seeing things. Fumes from all the Mako, maybe. All right. You got this.
Don't let the intruder escape. For you. Huh? A flower? That's right. It's a gift. You know, for scaring those things away. What things? Never mind. Think of it as a memento. Just my luck. I heard that, you know. How much? Well, that depends on the customer. In your case... <laughs> it's on the house. Huh? Lovers used to give these when they were reunited. Look, I'm involved in things. Dangerous things. Oh, I'm sure you are. So? So keep your distance. Wait, you think someone's out to get you? Is that what you're all worked up about? Relax. No one's going to attack you. I promise. Hey, a Mako reactor just blew. You shouldn't be out here trying to self- <gasps>
That bastard couldn't have gotten far! Stay alert! I don't want to stick around here. Rockets have been erected in the 
Now begin. To avoid accidents, prompt compliance with officer's instructions and advice. I repeat. Don't let him get away! No Stay matter what! From the Shinra emergency operation. Shoot to kill!
This cloud won't be joining us after all. No need to assume the worst. I'm sure he's fine. You saw him in action, didn't you? Guy's a soldier. Goddamn one-man army. Hmm. You think he's a keeper? Public security to run around. That's what. Had to draw them away from the station somehow. Nicely done. Well, can't argue with results, huh? <clears throat> what? <sighs> Wait. Got a question for you all. What? Ever been attacked by an invisible enemy? Wearing robes. Came and went like the wind. <laughs> Thought they were invisible. They were, at first. Only saw them after she grabbed me. A new Shinra weapon, maybe? <laughs> More like a panic-induced hallucination. <clears throat> Never mind. Forget I said anything. Suit yourself. Come on, let's move up. A lot of people here. And in the freight car, too. Because of the evacuation order, maybe? Lucky this us. We've got a crowd to hide in. Head for the front Sector of the train and hold there. City. Due to an explosion at Marco Reactor 1, an emergency schedule is now in effect. Your understanding and cooperation is appreciated. Highway collapse right in front of us. There's these assholes right for shitting on the No guards here, right? Wow, we get some different people riding the freight car. Plus, they don't have much choice, but. Oh, this is so cramped. Man, everyone's on edge. Of course they are. Hey, Cloud. No thief skin, my. I am. They even if you're about to unburden you yourself, don't do like those fires. You don't make it easy. Stop that right, right now! Hey, got a sec? You see, my daughter now lives in Sector you're, uh, 8, so... holding up pretty well, huh? Even after what we saw at the station and all over Sector 8? I'm a soldier. Wow. They caught the my hands are still yet. shaking. You get used to it. Something to look forward to. Or maybe not. You see, my daughter now lives in Sector 8, so... The fire was really big. I can't believe she said it was 
little help, Cloud? Please? I'm sure I can't stop thinking about it. Too. The bomb I made no, shouldn't have produced an explosion that, that big. It doesn't make any sense. The explosion triggered a reaction with the Mako. You said so yourself. That was my first guess, but shouldn't the reactor have fail-safes to prevent that kind of thing? Hmm. You mentioned invisible enemies back there, right? Right. Oh, no. I'm just looking for excuses for something that was clearly my own fault. <sighs> Gotta own up to it if I'm gonna learn from this and move on. Thanks, Cloud. You're a good listener. What kind of maniacs would go so far as to bomb a reactor? <sighs> They've yet to announce it publicly, but I heard it was Avalanche's doing. Really? Aren't they the terrorists who tried to kill the president? Is there nothing they won't do? Hey, quit talking out your ass. Everyone knows Avalanche only cares about saving the planet. Hmm? Just, just who do you think you are? A law-abiding concerned citizen. Law-abiding? Really? Hmm. Uh, uh, shh. In my humble opinion, that explosion was a message. A message to the bastards bleeding our planet dry. Think they got it? Heard it loud and clear? Y'all's masters? We will not submit to intimidation or violence, but work together for peace and prosperity. That is how civilized people change the world! That's right! That is the Shinra Creed! Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Those fighting words. It's what we believe. We all have to follow our conscience, don't we? We should go. Right. <laughs> out of the way. Personally, I find visual aids make the dull stuff a lot more bearable. If it helps, think of it as an initiation rite. How many times do I have to tell you people? I'm not... There's such a thing as playing too hard to get. So, here we've got a wireframe model of the great city of Midgar, complete with massive steel plates suspended 300 meters above ground level, atop which stands a shining beacon of civilization. The whole system is sustained by the Mako reactors, which feed the insatiable appetites of the public. The train will be passing through an ID uh. checkpoint shortly. This here is the train's route. As you can see, it'll take us around this main pillar. Look, we're about halfway through it now. They've set up a checkpoint here to scan the IDs of all passengers heading in and out. Date of birth, residential status, criminal history, all that and more is automatically cross-referenced in their databases. Public security wouldn't have it any other way. Heads up. <sighs> Don't worry. Our IDs are impeccable. What I tell ya? Have a little faith. Won't be long till we reach the bottom. Relax. Take a good look. It's because of that great big pizza in the sky that people down there got to struggle to survive. Shinra sucks up Mako. While the soil turns to dust, the air fills with smog, and the flowers die. Then leave and don't look back. <sighs> that's what's always worked for me. <sighs> well, that's all well and good. If you're only out for yourself. But the folks down there don't have the luxury of choice, you know? I 
take this train, I suppose. There's only one way it can go. One, members lost zero. And one step closer to a brighter future. Hell yeah! Guys! Lower your voices, huh? People are listening. Oh, God. Right. <laughs> ah. hm. Now get some r, r You've earned it. Just be ready for the next mission, all right? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> See you soon. Uh, at Seventh Heaven. You know, where Tifa works. Don't keep her waiting. She'll worry. the ground shaped like that. What kind of... Apparently Shinra thinks it's a good thing. So I'm afraid he's only had huh? All that debris piled up like mountains. You couldn't go nowhere. Huh. Mako is the lifeblood of the planet? Yeah, the hell it is. Goddamn eco-warriors with their dumbass posters. I tear them down and they're back up inside of an hour. Like I've got nothing better to do. I mean, look at all that steelwork. You trying to tell me that's not progress? <laughs> what the? You okay, buddy? <laughs> Mako junkie, huh? Figures. Shower can't come soon enough. I can barely tell my skin from all the ash and sweat. Warning. Gate broken. Fiends in area. Exercise caution. No reason to check it out. Not my problem. You don't want to mess with the monsters in here. Move we'll along now. Um, excuse me, uh, due to an emergency, entry into this area is prohibited. Sorry for the inconvenience. You call that a warning? No, sir!
Are they going to turn the reactor off? Why did people blow it up? What do you know? That ain't half bad. I'll make a grease monkey out of you yet. Thanks. I want a drink with tea for so bad. Who wouldn't? She's a looker. A bombshell, even. What if I use her meathead friends to get to her? Yeah? He'd smash your face in if he ever found out. <laughs> Have you been a good girl? Yeah, I've been helping Tifa. <laughs> oh, you did, did you? Well, well. <laughs> you made it. <laughs> Where'd you get that? I can't remember the last time I saw a real one. <laughs> huh? <sighs> How sweet. When did you get so thoughtful? A guy can change. It has been five years. Huh? I need to talk to Barrett. Right. Come on in. Daddy, the Mako place blew up. Everyone on TV is talking about it. Don't you worry about all that silliness. Daddy's here and he's not going anywhere tonight. Now turn that thing off and let's get you to bed, huh? Yeah, yeah, your money. Ask Tifa. She takes care of all that. Uh. <laughs> hey! What uh, the hell do you think you're doing scaring my daughter like that? Daddy says never talk to strangers. <laughs> That's right, honey. I do say that. What a good girl you are remembering Daddy's lessons. <laughs> You know what else good girls do? They go to bed on time. Come on. But I'm not tired. I want to talk some more, Daddy. Mm, all right, but just this once. <sighs> uh, so then, what can I get you? My money. I'm still waiting on it. Uh, right. About that. We should talk outside. Um, Daddy, did the people who died all return to the planet? Of course. Before we get on to money, there's an empty apartment in a place just down the road. It's nothing fancy, but I was thinking you could stay there for now. The landlady's a big friend of the cause, so you wouldn't even have to pay rent. Sound good? Sure does. Thanks. <laughs> Follow me then. How was it up on the plate? It was chaotic. Sorry for dragging you into all this. It was wrong of me to put you in danger wow, like that. I promise I won't do it again. Dangerous part of the job. Don't worry about me. <laughs> I'll try not to. Always happy to help Welcome stick it to Shimmer. Was <laughs> on you I don't know what it is, but so, you so make nice with everyone? As much as I could, all things considered. Maybe not enough for them. Good. You had me worried. You're not exactly a people person. I'll give you that. I saw Sector 8 on the news. It was like a war zone. 
The news is just another Shinra mouthpiece. We'll spread whatever lies Shinra What's tells them to. to, happen to us? So, How will this it wasn't us? that bad? It was. Oh, right. And here we are, good old Stargazer Heights. You're on the second floor. Room 201 here is where I sleep. Don't have time for much else, what with Seventh Heaven and all. <laughs> Not even time to decorate. Here's your room, 202. Don't worry, I already told the landlady about you. You did? Yes? Oh, I mean I told her I had a friend looking for a place to stay. Was that too much? No. It's fine. And this? That one's, uh... Know what? It's getting late. I'll introduce you tomorrow. It's a little bare, but should be enough to get you through the night. If you want anything else, we can always there get it- There is one thing. My money. You guys owe me 2,000, remember? I do. And we'd love to settle up, especially since this was your first job for us, but... That's it? Sorry. We spent the rest preparing for the mission. That really is it. But not for long. I'm collecting money for filters tomorrow, so I can pay you after. <sighs> and you're sure about that? Of course, as long as you help, that is. Wait, then I'd have to pay you for that, too. Never mind. No, two thousand's enough. That's what we agreed on, so that'll be the price. With what you gave me, that leaves fifteen hundred. You're the best! I'll see you bright and early at the bar, then. Thanks again for everything. Sleep tight. Guess it's time for introductions. Hey, you okay in there? Oh. Coming in. But he's not a bad guy. The landlady asked me to check on him now and then to make sure he's okay. Can I ask you to do the same? Sure.
Well now, you must be Cloud. <sighs> I'm Marl, your landlady. So how'd you like the place? You from up on high? I've been around. I'll bet. No matter. All kinds come through with all kinds of reasons. If you ever need an ear to bend, I'll lend you mine. Can be about anything, even Tifa. What's she to you? The granddaughter I never had. And if you hurt her, I'll take it out of your hide. You hear me? Loud and clear. Good. Now you'd best get a move on to Seventh Heaven. She's got a head start on you and then some. saying they're gonna step searching for candidates no way it's in our place I'll start looking for a new one Back to gotta the admit the watch Morning. Hey. Just so you know, Marlene's still asleep. <sighs> Let's get down to business, shall we? Huh? These water filters won't replace themselves. <sighs> Although the next batch probably could, if Jessie put her mind to it. <sighs> Most every home in the area has one. Folks love them because they practically eliminate the rotten egg smell. Honestly, they make us more money than this place. And it's easy money, too. <sighs> we bring new filters, collect the old ones, and get paid. What? Huh. Give me a break. I'm not a salesman. I'm a soldier. Which is why no one will refuse to pay. What do you uh. say? Please? <sighs> Let's get this over with. Great. And while we're at it, I'll give you the grand tour. Collect. Seeing as you didn't bring any luggage, I'm guessing there's stuff you need to buy. Thanks. And don't worry, we'll pay you the difference after. Barrett's out making his rounds too. As long as I get it all today.
How's it about you? Somebody ought to do something. Some creepy dude who hit on me was asking all kinds of strange questions about Seventh Heaven. You talking about the creep? Chili beans! Get your chili beans! Wife's probably gonna give me all the items you could want straight from the plate. No matter your needs or your budget, our wide selection of items is guaranteed to satisfy. You a lover? You hey a there. fighter? No worries. Here to change out your water anything filter. and everything you Do can you possibly baby, need. baby, how you doing? Before. Been waiting for you to... Wait, who is he? Cloud's in charge of collections. He'll take your money. Sounds like a pretty sweet gig. If you ever need someone to fill in, I'm your man. In your dreams, maybe. Huh? Cloud! Uh, since we're here, maybe we should do a little shopping. Suppose I could take a look. If you're ever in the market for anything else, drop on by. Especially if Teeth is with you. We'll see you around, okay? And let us know when your filter next needs changing. All the items you could want straight from the plate. No matter your needs or your budget, our wide selection of items is... He's a regular. Stock up here, and he might throw in a freebie or two. For you, maybe. Well, you could try being a little nicer. To get free shit? Not my style. <laughs> Our next stop is Stargazer Heights. Landlady's laid as a client. Just met her. Then you know what to expect. Remember, she's a good friend of Avalanche, so be nice. Please... Can't help but take a little pleasure in their panic. Hey, Marl. Got some filters for ya. Tifa! My dear, dear girl! Oh, what's he doing here? Working? Be nice. <laughs> Cloud's helping me with collections. You'd better take care of her. I'm pretty good at taking care of myself, you know. That I do. Still, better him than you. No charm, no wit. Big sword, but no skills. I've got skills. Be nice. I'm doing my best. You're looking awfully glum. Are you getting enough sleep? A good long rest to cure anything, I tell you. A tried and true lesson for life on the ground floor, am I right? That you are. Now, your money. Thanks, Marl. You take care of yourself. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Marl's great. She helped get me set up back in the day. You been here a while now? Five years, give or take. Uh, but never mind that. We've got to get you your money. Last stop is the weapons drawer. Don't try anything funny or you'll get it. The kids seem to think you're pretty cool. Hey! That last filter didn't do shit! We're so sorry about that. Hopefully this one will work better. Save your excuses and get out! All right. If you could just settle your bill, we'll be on our way. The hell? 
You charging me for your busted ass goods? My associate handles payment disputes. Think you can mosey up in here and have it your way? Pretty please. <laughs> Thank you very much. Seeing as we're done with our rounds and you've got a small fortune now, why not take a gander at the weapons? Well, when will Barrett be back with the rest? <sighs> Before we open up tonight. It'll be a while yet, so... What do you want to do? Don't really know. In that case, I've got a suggestion. Want to hear it? If you're serious about becoming a merc, then you're going to need to start making connections. It's not what you know, but who you know, you know? Hmm. Another lesson for life on the ground floor? Yep. Connections get you jobs. Jobs build your rep. And more rep gets you better connections. How do I start? Hmm. Why not help out the Neighborhood Watch? They're mostly volunteers, but you'll get to know people. Yeah, okay. Didn't see anybody at the office, so let's head up top. Huh? I ain't got nothing for a punk-ass bitch like you! Get on out of here! I wonder... No better way to keep you and your family safe than with a weapon of your own. Come and check out our selection. Speak with our friendly staff to find the perfect weapon for you and your needs. No better way to keep you and your family safe than with a weapon of your own. Come and check out... Gotta do something about the monsters on Scrap Boulevard. I'll head on down there first thing to... Huh. Didn't know you were holding down the fort. Huh? Oh, hey, Cloud. Um, Looking to join the Neighborhood Watch? That depends. What does this Neighborhood Watch do? Uh, lots of stuff, really. But our top priority is taking care of any beasts that wander into town. That, and teaching the locals how to defend themselves. Like they say, the only one who will look out for you is you. Cloud's a great fighter, but only we know that. If no one knows him, no one will hire him. Thought if he joined the watch, he could get his name out there. That would work for everybody. Truth be told, we could really use your help. We can't pay you in kill, but we'll work something out. For example... Aha! What about your sword? I could mod it for you. No thanks. It's fine just the way it is. What? You some kind of purist? I know I'd never pass up a chance to improve my gear. Come on. At least let me show you how it's done. All set? Needless to say, you'll have to try it out to appreciate the difference. Thanks. <laughs> we'll do you one better. Spread the word to everyone who'll listen about the new Merc in town. Between him and Wedge, there isn't anyone they don't know. I'll march through the streets singing your praises, even on an empty stomach. So, where are these monsters? Scrap Boulevard. Good hunting. Hey, Cloud. I'll come with. No. I've got this. But 
You don't know the way, do you? Lead on. <laughs> sure thing. I know these streets better than anyone. to keep the monsters out anymore. Anyway, we should prepare, just in case. Huh? I ain't got nothing for a punk-ass bitch like you! Get on out of here! I wonder... There's no better way to keep you and your family safe. See why monsters would feel right at home. And the more we pile up, the more they show up. That's what a soldier looks like in action. This was just a warm-up. <laughs> I'll bet. Let's keep at it. I'll take the lead. in like it was nothing you too it's a little surprising well i've been here five you keep now. it together i you don't look out for yourself no gotcha. one else can. Bye. Bye. That one yeah. that's awesome. a lesson all right i think that might be the last of them they won't stay gone for long. Of course not. Even so, folks will be grateful for the peace and quiet in the meantime. A win's a win, you know? True. Trust me, it'll do wonders for your rep. Right. Let's go check in with Biggs and Wedge.
searching for candidates. Tally of Monster Slaying has been updated. Got new numbers for Monster Slaying this month. Check them out. You hear someone got rid of all the monsters? Back already? Got every last one, too. Now the slum should be safe. You guys are machines! Good job. Meanwhile, we told everyone we could about you. So I heard. I've gotta ask, though. What did you tell them? It's all right. All you gotta do is keep up the good work. It'll pay off soon enough, I promise. How's the sword, by the way? Good. Glad to hear it. Seems like the perfect fit for you. Yeah. We've been through a lot. Oh. You okay? I'm fine. Been meaning to ask. After you left the village... It's a long story. I've got time. Why don't you tell me all about it while we try to wrestle up some more work for you? That sounds great! I'll come too! Oh, uh, no you won't. What? Run along now, you two. Uh, Sorry, go on. maybe uh. next time. Huh? No fair! Uh, think about it for a second. They haven't seen each other in years. You'd be a third wheel. Uh. <sighs> hey, before we get back to it, why don't you check out the weapons? No need. Come on, the dealer's probably heard all about you by now. Might treat you better. I don't know about that. There's a merc that'll take on any monster. You the man? Word spreads fast around here. What if I am? Sorry about before. I get antsy when business is slow. Ugh. That man in your line of work needs weapons, no? Why not try that one on for size? Yours on the house. Badass like you rocking my weapons is good advertising. Think about it. Fine. Or if you want to take a look at something else. Just a look. Don't be a stranger! Since you've got yourself a new weapon, let's see if we can't put it to good use. Come on, let's go chat up Weimer. Who? The guy who tracks all the requests that come to the watch. You never know, could toss some work your way. Where's he at? Oh, he should be back at the office by now.
Searching for candidates. Ah, uh, hey there, Tifa. You need a helping hand? Actually, I wanted to introduce you to an old friend of mine. This is Cloud. He's a merc. Ah, uh, you don't say. Well, we're always on the lookout for experienced fighters to help us deal with the bigger critters. I'll take on anything. For the right price, that is. Experienced and cocky, huh? If it's a challenge you want, I might have a few good ones. Your clients can fill you in on the details. Prove yourself at these jobs, and I'll see if I can't find you some more. Thanks. Candidate detected. Performing physical analysis. Sizable weapon. Excellent cardiovascular health and impressive lung capacity. Perfectly balanced muscle and bone structure. An optimal candidate! My name is Chadley. I'm an intern for Shinra's Research and Development Division. I hope you'll be interested in helping me with my research. Please accept this as a down payment. I would like you to set that assessed materia in your equipment and use it to gather intelligence in battle. This data will help me to develop new types of materia. I'm not interested in working for Shinra. You should know that I work actively to undermine Shinra's efforts. I'm sure you of all people can appreciate the tremendous power of materia, as well as how it might be wielded against your corporate enemies. And if you later decide that I am not worthy of your trust, you can do what you do best. I will hold you to that. Excellent! Then we shall work together so long as you deem fit. Once you've completed your task, please return and report to me. Please set the orb of assess materia to your equipment and use it to gather battle intel. I hear you sell swords. Hey, you just opened up shop in here. That the childhood <clears throat> friend from out of town. she can help me find my friends. I know someone who can help you. This guy right here. Really? Okay, let me tell you all about them. They have long arms and legs, and they're a little skinny. They like places where there's food, and nice people will give them treats when they ask. And small spaces. Oh yeah, and they're all cats. I'm looking for cats. They're friendly, so if you call them, they'll come running. All three of them. Find my friends, please. Regular? 